Discernment can be hard, and the first step to discerning the priestly vocation is asking, do I want to be diocesan or religious? First, let's get this across. Both are priests. Sometimes diocesans get bashed for being administrative, being boring, or too clerical, etc. Which isn't true. You find those, those isolated cases in both diocesan and religious life. Diocesans and religious can both celebrate Mass, hear confession, do all the sacraments and everything else priests do. Diocesan priests obey a bishop who is appointed by the Pope. They normally are restricted to their diocese and work in parishes but can also be hospital chaplains, teachers, or work in a chancellor. Religious obey an abbot, a general custodian, a superior general, or any other name that they have for the leader that they elect. Religious also, but not always, have a habit. These are examples of the habits of the missionary servants of the Most Holy Trinity, the Franciscan or the Benedictines. Religious are not restricted to a diocese, and they can be found all over the world in different missions in different provinces around the world. Diocesans and religious take different vows. Diocesan priests take two vows, chastity and obedience, to their local bishop. Religious take three vows, chastity, obedience, and poverty. Some communities take four vows. For example, the Legionnaires of Christ, they take a fourth vow to the Pope. Life as either of the two can be different. As a diocesan priest, you most usually take care of and reside in a parish, which is really exciting as you're kind of the guardian of the sacrament. You are an emergency room physician with knowledge of all the fields, whereas religious are specialists, like cardiologists. And this is because religious have a charism to follow, such as teaching, cleaning, or like my community, preserving the faith. Religious also usually live in community with other members of their community. There are also different types of religious, like contemplatives, or like my community, missionaries. But no matter what you choose, no matter how you s choose to serve God, the most important thing to remember is... So please, like, comment, subscribe, double click, heart, whatever it is that you do. Like me on Facebook, uh, Nick Torres. Follow me on Instagram at Nick, the number three, sheep. And subscribe on YouTube, Nick, space, Torres, the number three.